everybody. Hi, can you see me? Hello, hello. How is everybody doing? It is finally Friday evening. Finished the entire week of work. And then now we have arrived to the weekend. <coughs> hello, hello, Adriana. How are you? Dah habis kerja? Relax, relax sikit. Jumaat. Okay. Okay, jom kita hari ni main dengan pisau, ya? Ha, ha. Hai, Farah. Masak apa? Nanti tengok, eh. Dila. Adila, how are you? So, hari ni the cases berapa, ya? 12,000 kan? Oh my god, 12,500 something. My goodness, what is happening? What is happening? So, all of you just jaga-jaga. Please take care of yourself. It is not over yet. Ya, yeah, EMCO dah not over. Tapi, you have to take care lah, ya? Yeah? Especially, hi Farah. Ya, yeah, 12,000. Alayi, how are you? Ya, yeah, those... Those of you who are feeling very tired, you know, why am I feeling exhausted? I'm not going anywhere, so I feel so exhausted, you know, the mental is very tiring, yeah, I understand. The whole day looking at the laptop, the whole day at home, um, no, going nowhere, you know. But don't worry, hang on, hang on, my dear friends, because <coughs> uh, your safety matters, your health matters, okay? So we have to take care of ourselves. Yes. Always, yeah, we have to, <laughs> yeah, so, relax, relax, if your friend needs to chat, yeah, just, just chat with them, yeah, if you need to chat also, you need to reach out to your friends also, please do, please do, don't simpan dalam hati, don't pendamkan everything, you know, yeah, just chat, and then, uh, like what I'm doing here now, I am uh, sharing my Friday evening with all of you with my cooking story this Friday evening. It is still my cooking stories. Birthday bash. Hello, Jamie. Hello, Joma. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Masa apa lagi hari ni? Ya, yeah, kita jom kita tengok. Actually, as I, 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 I uh, uh, while I'm doing this, also I'm tengah masak saya punya supper lah. Okay, I hope all of you are eating, uh, have eaten, or if you're eating and watching me, thank you very much. Thank you. Welcome to my cooking story. Live. Hi, Max. So, uh, let's go to happier news. Happier news, which is my cooking stories. Uh, birthday bash is still ongoing the whole month of July, okay? With 80%, uh, discounts up to 80%. And then also free shipping throughout uh, Peninsula Malaysia uh, only in July, okay? Only in July. Yesterday, 15th of July is uh, my cooking story's real birthday you know they started this on 15th july last year um 12 months later here they are uh they have provided a lot of quality and affordable uh, cookware bakeware kitchenware i use them a lot and then yeah thank you my cooking story for having me for having me so today malam ini saya akan guna combo apa ya yeah? so what kind of combo i'm gonna use what uh combo attracted me to do my cooking story today Last week I did uh, Jasmine's faith. This week I'm going tonight. I'm going to do Suha's faith. Suha, if you are watching, I really like your combo. My your combo inspired me to make a story today. Suha, Suha, saya suka you punya combo. <laughs> okay, so what will you get in uh, Suha's uh, faith now? Suha's faith, you buka ada satu. One, two, three, not even four. You get five things. Five things in Suha's combo, okay? What will you get? First, you will get this 28cm, very handsome, non-stick wok, okay? Second, you will get this uh, chopper. Let me see this chopper. 17cm, very nice, uh, neat chopper. And then you will get this board, this very cute looking flower board now don't look at this board so cute ah uh. hi cecilia hi good evening good evening thank you for coming hi everybody so this cute board don't underestimate it it's pretty but it's very durable okay okay what you get ah uh? okay, one two three not only that 
you get the knife and you get this sharpening rod sharpening rod later i'm going to show you oh you like that walk yeah adriana that walk okay if you want to buy that walk individually right uh, it is now 98 ringgit but if you buy with suha's combo you, you are gonna save uh 34 ringgit lah altogether so you will have this rod to sharpen your knife later i'm going to show you how to properly sharpen your knives okay don't simply simply sharpen because safety is involved and then fifth one you will get this one uh, this borosilicate square uh, uh, glass container, okay? So I'm going to tell you why this is important. I have been finding high and low for this and finally I got it in my cooking story. Hi, Alexander. Oh, Asian parents favorite smack the kids with weapon. Wow, you're going to smack the kids with this. Uh, don't, don't, don't. Okay, so this one, it is... Uh, hold on, hold on. It is... Uh, also very safe for microwave oven let me put this carefully um, it's actually uh, airtight and also uh, liquid can uh, withstand liquid also because it has a rubber across that uh, across that lid okay with the, with that five items that combo five items let me show you now how to uh, Sharpen the knife. Okay, this is also this is called an iron. No, this is not to whack your kids. Okay, this is an ironing board. Uh, no, not an ironing board. Ironing uh steel rod. A steel rod to sh ironing board. Steel rod to <laughs> sharpen or hone your knife. Okay, usually what you see in the chefs in the chef. Uh, hi, even how are you? So usually what you see uh, in the cook shows, right? They go usually like this. Okay. Uh, I'm telling you, please do not do this. Please do not do this. Okay, those who come in, hello, good Friday evening. Hello, Wen Kiong. Uh, those who came in, hi. Uh, we are doing. We are looking at the Suha's Faith. Okay, Suha's Faith, which has five items. These, hi Manjit, hi, which has uh, includes these two: the honing rod, uh, the sharpening rod, and also the 17 cm chopper. Okay, we call it the, this cleaver or the chopper. So you do this. If this is not a kung fu, uh, don't make your kitchen a kung fu place or an acrobat place, okay? Those master chefs and those chef shows, they do this all the time before they cut something. Okay, this one will be very, very dangerous. Hello, Chen Kid and Judy. Hi. Good evening. So, when you do this, right, it's very dangerous. Although it has this barrier here, this barrier here for you to protect your fingers and hands, right? Uh, don't do this, please, because you will all oh, look at this. I can't bear to imagine also the consequences. So, most important is safety, all right? This one, only those cook shows do it. Even the chefs, they admit this is just to, you know, sharpen your ego, just to uh, show off, okay? You don't show off in the kitchen, you put safety first. So, also, when they do this, your kids also will follow and then it's not good. And also some people like to sharpen. Hi, Sinli. Hi, hi, hi. So they like to sharpen with a bowl. Remember how those YouTube people show you those hacks, right? Sharpen with a bowl. Well, I think you're going to have to shave some of those ceramic around your place. Yeah? And then you're going to eat it. Not very safe. Lah, okay. Or you go and take the back of the cup. You know the back of the cup. Oh my goodness. Please don't do this. And when you do this, your kids will start to do this. So don't do this. Do it the proper way. Okay. This one, this kind of uh, rod is good for you to do it uh, every day, hone it every day. When you hone it, your blades, right, will be straightened. Okay, hello, Von Von. Your blades will be straightened also. Okay, and then um, it has these grooves here. Can you see the grooves? It will shave some of the uh, uh, steel, some of the steel. And then, uh, what's the, the difference between this and those wetting, uh, those uh, stone, right? Those sharpening stone, wetting stone is that the wetting stone is for um, for extremely shaving off a lot of the. Uh, if your knife is very very blunt, you need a high performance sharpener. Then you do that. But for every day, you know, hello Max. Every day, you know, you have to maintain. Your knives, okay, knives come with maintenance one, right? Don't think that knives are here forever being uh, very sharp. Okay, so let me teach you this one. First, you have to put it on a piece of wet cloth so that it won't uh, move, yeah? So you put it here and then 
you uh, put it at uh, 20 degrees 20 degrees uh, this is how to estimate 20 degrees is 90 and then you put half which is uh, 45 and then put another half which is 22.5 uh, it don't really matter but a 2.5 degree angle but so you get my point so you go this side and one side each for 10 to 20 times okay this is how you hold your knife make it straight and from the heel from the heel to the tip okay hi those who came in how are you good friday evening I'm i am showing you how to hold your knife properly safely and so that you have a nice sharp knife you know those who are interested in this combo you can type there jl plus one jl for july yeah uh, jl plus one if you want two sets jl plus two and then our my cooking story friends will come and help you so this has a very nice wooden rod here hi Mordred, how are you so you go like this for 10 to 20 times uh equal um equal times each side yeah hello girl no kuchil sharper knife you should max <laughs> okay so you go like this wow look at the sound can you hear the sound it looks like it comes from a, a thriller movie right okay so now that you have sharpened it it is ever very very important to use sharp knife because if it's blunt it will uh, be very dangerous for you because you're trying to put pressure when you try to put pressure on it you know you cannot you lose control and then you underestimate the pressure and then things happen okay so the best is not to put your thumb in front of the blade and then you rub it and test it and please do not do that all right what you're gonna do is to take something like a tomato okay tomato and you do the tomato test so you can roughly feel if it's really blunt you your tomato will be squished you need to squish and squish only your tomato will be uh, cut but this one no need you just a little bit pressure so what you could do now is I'm gonna show you also how the importance of the chopping board okay let me show you this chopping board okay why you need a chopping board at home have you ever wondered why don't you just put it on the surface the hard surface the harder the better right and then what you can clean it off later no actually the chopping board this you can get for uh, $24.88 yeah, if you put in my uh, code here, you get a 10% discount. Make sure all of you leave with a 10% discount, okay? Okay, this one is sweet. Yeah, it's so pretty. I like to put it in my uh, fruit basket, okay? So this pre uh, pretty board, uh, I'll just use it to cut some tomatoes for my soup later. And uh, during my cooking, I will also invite my uh, special guest. I haven't seen her for some time. My special guest, uh, those of you who can guess, who do you think she is? Okay, oh, it's a she, is it? Okay, so let's do the uh, tomato test. Yeah, of course, this is um, very sharp already. So I'm going to just cut it. I'm going to cut some slices for my soup later. Who likes tomato soup? Who likes tomato soup? Very, very good with a lot of uh, vitamins okay so with a sharp knife you can see it is very very uh, you can cut thin slices and no worries okay and you will you will feel very nice um, preparing your food because most of the food is 80% preparation and just 20% dumping it every inside so you want your 80% to feel really comfortable really nice not struggling with the, with the, with the knife then go ahead do this Okay, hello Yang Yang, how are you? Have you been studying well? Okay, hi guys, those who come in, this is the Suha's fave. This is the Suha's fave. Um, I'm gonna cut some tomatoes. Okay, I've been using this board, this sweet board for some time now, so uh, it is very uh, resistant to scratches. Okay, um, it is made of let me put it in a bowl it is made of the medium density fiber board uh, it is uh, made of synthetic rubber and uh, plastic so you can put this is very good because you can wash it in the dishwasher uh, so it is you can get rid of the bacteria yeah and the oil easily Okay, I like to do this with fruits because it looks so sweet. Look, look, look how sweet it is. Okay, let me cut some prawns also. Um, I'm 
I'm gonna put some prawns because today I'm feeling chop chop like kung fu. <laughs> oh, thank you for the nice cut, uh, nice nice uh, knife skills you say, Alexander. Okay, so I'm gonna devein the uh, prawns. Deveining the prawns also you have to cut through the shell. So what you need to do is sharp knives. Okay, you can't do that with a blunt knife. It will just cut your fingers. Okay, just devein some prawns for later. Who likes it? Who likes it? Uh, okay, before I go on to some uh, cooking with my guest. Do you all know who's the guest? Hello, Siti. How are you? How are you? I know you also pandai masak. You also like to play masak-masak at home, right? Yep, yep, yep. Hello guys, welcome to the My Cooking Story Birthday Bash. Today we're gonna use Suha's Fave. Okay, Suha's Fave. Alright, uh, just cut some veggies. You need some veggies. I like to put some greens in my soup. Later we'll have a healthy meal, okay? Because if not, no fiber cannot lah. You need some healthy meal. And then um, I'm gonna show you how... We do. I know some of you are really great chefs out there, really great cook. So I'm just going to show you how to do um, a very uh, healthy meal. Fast, quick, so that you don't have to toil in the kitchen for a very long time. Hello Chuan, how are you Chuan? How are you doing? What are you cooking today? Have you had your dinner? Okay, I hope you're happy. If you're having your dinner, I hope this is entertaining you. <laughs> okay, let's wipe off this. Uh, wipe off this a little bit. <laughs> okay, so what I like to do to promote healthy eating, yeah, people are lazy to take the chopboard, is I like to put a basket like this and then put this sweet chopboard here. How does it look? And then put in your tea time corner. Do you have a tea time table corner? And put it like this. And then if you feel like eating some fruits, take the fruit, take this one, cut it and eat it from it. And serve it from it as well. It's so sweet and pretty, okay? It's really durable. You can put it in a dishwasher. Um, matte texture so that it won't, uh, it's durable to scratch. Okay, so this, let me put aside. Hello, hello, good evening. So later, what are we going to cook, yeah? What did you have for dinner? So if you like this Suha's fave, it's 168 ringgit. Let me clean some of this uh, off my top first. I uh, like a clean kitchen. So if you like this Suha's fave, um, it is 168, but with the code, you get a 10% discount, 10% off, and then... Um, you get 10% off and it's only 151 ringgit and 20 cents. Make sure all of you get the 10% discount because it's store wide and also in July, totally free shipping in Peninsula, Malaysia. You have chicken chop for dinner. Wow, that's nice. Okay, you can ask your wife to buy a knife or you buy for her, so very good. And then she can chicken chop more chop more chicken chops for you. Okay. So, are we ready for our guest? Uh, for our guest, I'm going to use this um, very handsome wok. It's 28 cm. It's very deep, so it's good for cooking pancakes. Non-stick, yeah? Nice uh, pancakes, nice omelette, and then you can make soup out of it with a lot of gravy, you know, curry. I like deep woks like this. Okay, so as you can see, it's very aesthetically pleasing. All my cooking stories, things are very nice one. So, Hokkien Bihun, but not yet eat. Oh, eating now. Ah. Okay, okay. So, um, this is my cooking story. As you can see, the uh, things are very aesthetically nice. Makes you want to cook more. And then you see the texture is matte surface. So, that is really uh, good quality non-stick. And then, uh... It has this really nice um, shining metallic feeling so it you can surf off this as well okay and then uh, it has this PFOA free material which means the plastic is 
a good quality uh, it's not, it doesn't have this non stick plastic that will harm your health and then it has five layers of alloy and then it is also good for ceramic box uh, no ceramic stove electrical stove gas stove and induction stove okay Emily if you're watching thank you for giving me this tip whenever you go shopping for wax right what are you gonna do you take a magnet and you put it on if it's on means it's induction cooker safe induction uh, stove safe yeah but it's written all for those uh, quality wax it's written all in their packaging you don't have to go and take a magnet and, and go shopping for the wax okay now let's invite our guest on some stuff uh, very cool. I oil. like how you prepare your food oil uh, finishing mushroom powder uh, finishing okay I've been cooking a lot so this is my mushroom powder <laughs> uh, tomatoes chopped eggs of course yeah uh, actually they don't have celery but I like to put some celery just to have some color and different taste and garlic Okay, so all right, I'm gonna start cooking right now. 
Okay, so I heated the hot wok, yeah, I heated the wok. So this kind of nice wok, right, makes me want to cook more. Okay, nice kitchenware. There you go. Okay, so for this one, I'm going to show you that it's really non-stick. So therefore, I'm going to... Usually, you can put a little bit of oil. Uh, doesn't mean that non-stick is uh, totally oil free. Uh, but then for this, I want to show you how non-stick this is. So... Okay. Let's look at this non-stick omelette. You can see my stuff. Uh. I'm going to transform the omelette into a soup. I think I should try what I like. I like, I like, I like. Y'all can see better here, right? Yeah, okay. Hello, Yang Yang. How are you? Can you see what I'm... Do you like eggs? Who likes eggs? Who's like egg fanatic and have eggs and you know eggs can transform your food into a plate from a plain one into a very delicious one. Who agrees? Okay. Chakwitiao, chakwitiao. Like chakwitiao with duck eggs. Okay, let's see. Garlic. Wow, I like garlic also. Yeah. A must have. You know, Dila, you can take those camping uh, camping stove, right? And then kita masak-masak together lah. Me, me, me. Okay, let's see how she makes her soup with her eggs. And I make my soup with eggs. Uh, my eggs. <laughs> egg people. <laughs> yes, it's easy. easy. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Okay. I also have this, you know, I forgot to show you guys. Can't really see, huh? This is like the glassware from MCS as well. I like, you see, I told you I like everything with lid, right? So I even got the one with the lid. So this one can put soup, and then this one can serve with dry stuff. Yeah. I like things with value. So the egg is nearly ready. And you see, I'm trying it. Yvonne, Yvonne, look, Yvonne, look. Look, I'm trying this Japanese rolling thing. Wow! Oh, no. I'm looking. Oh, I hope it doesn't spill. I hope it doesn't spill. I want that totally round booster egg. The egg like a balsa with that, and not like a booster. Oh my goodness! Please don't spill, please, please. Perfect. I love the omelet. I love omelet. What do you like to put in omelet? Mushroom, capsicum, okay. chili. Wow! Well, yeah, tomato. Tomato. Your tomato. Put tomato. Uh. Okay, I'm able to roll this or not. Hi! Hi, Hasana, how are you? I tengah buat telur ni, telur. Telur yang boleh roll punya, boleh lipat punya ni. You know, my sister is... <laughs> what? Like in the day, you're an engineer, and then at night, you have to flip eggs. What, what are you doing, man? What is MCO do doing to us? You know, now you have to do everything. Okay, the egg looks good. So what I'm going to do is I am going to use this board. You can see I put it here. I'm going to put the egg here and then I'm going to cut it. I'm going to cut it, cut it. This one is good for pancakes. Don't stick. Look, because it has a very nice uh, matte texture. Yeah. If you want to buy this wok, just this wok stand alone, it is 28 cm. It is 98 ringgit. Okay, but if you buy it with the Suha Spade, it comes with five items. And these five items, you'll be saving 34 ringgit 20 cents. So, it's a very good set lah. I think I like Suha Suha, Saya Suka, You Punya Combo. If you're listening, give me a like. Yeah, those who have seen... Uh, oh my goodness. Flip, come on, flip. Okay, I have a bowl of <laughs> okay. Wow, you're so good, man. <laughs> Hello, hello. Okay, I'm gonna transfer this here. Ah, yeah. Uh, my bolster broke. I'm gonna transfer it here. It is uh, made of okay. about 500 ml. 500 ml. No, okay. I can't put too much. This I is an uh, induction cooker. Friendly, right? You can go into the dishwasher. So after this, you can go into the dishwasher. Uh, Non-stick finish, very matte surface. So as you can see, just now easily, uh, very easy. The egg just didn't stick. Okay, it is also... I'm going to put into the soup now. Now I've uh, prepared some chicken soup. 
Okay, very easy to make chicken soup. Uh, this container comes with the soup pass babe, okay? Okay, it doesn't drip. Just now I didn't close the lid. Makes me hungry again. You just come down lah. <laughs> no, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna pour this inside the wok here and make a soup out of it. Okay. Right, Ooh. this chicken. I'm gonna use this bag later. Because mm. you put some water for to come for that evaporation. Hello, hello, those who came in. Uh, this is the My Cooking Story live with my sister Bon Bon. How how's it going, Bon? Oh, you're cooking. Already? I'm letting it simmer for a while. Okay. I'm letting mine so simmer for a while. <laughs> well, waiting so for you. Uh, Hi, Yang Yang. You try cooking? Sorry, my phone keep wobbling because it's like my, <laughs> my phone handle. Mm -hmm. Omelette. It's really easy. Sometimes, you know, I know you're still at home, but then preparing food, oh my goodness. But anyway, Does you got the MCO, after MCO lifted, right? You all have to be, you have to take care as well, okay? No, I don't know if the restaurants are going to be open, but do take care. Yvonne, I don't know if I can yep. see you already. I can see you already, then we cook together, live. Okay. Okay, put in the soup, put in the omelet. And I'm going to put in the tomato that I've just cut. I also have tomato. Really easy, really Your easy, eggs guys. Are floating. <laughs> Pardon? Your eggs are floating. <laughs> okay. So you can dice your eggs like Yvonne. How, how, how? Finish with Yvonne? So no, I'm not going to simmer for a while. Let me put me. <laughs> you love soup? Oh, me la. too. Dila, yeah, I, 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 I love soup so much that let me show you. I've got like two pressure cookers at home just to make soup. <laughs> oh, I don't want to jump up here. Yeah, yeah, I like to drink soup Yvonne makes. Really nice. Okay, I let it simmer for a while and then now I put in my mushroom powder. Okay, it doesn't look nice, oh, yeah, but this is mushroom powder. Nice. I just need chicken stock. Yeah. You love soup. Yeah, yeah remember. I need chicken stock. Put in the okay, put in the greens. I like this tiny cabbage. So we have yellow, we have red, we have green. You know, make your dish colorful so that you know that bulbaga nutrients from our soap. Make sure you have healthy meal, yeah. Healthy meal is important. Okay, I'll put in my celery. Wow, we also look like steamboat now. Yeah. yeah, it is a little mini steamboat. Okay, put it to high heat. Let it simmer a real while. Let the... Uh, Soup go in, soup go in, pull up the fragrance of the egg go in, and because your food. Can you see? Wow, that's nice. Egg drop. When are you gonna drop the egg? Like anytime now? Anytime now? Ah, yeah. Yes, those who go. Oh, well, carbohydrate is not that bad, right? You want this. This is also from my cooking story. So if you, I, I prepared these uh, glass noodles. You know, now you have this uh, konjac noodle, right? You can also put konjac noodle inside. And let me put this. So it's like, sepinggan lengkap, you know? Like one dish, everything is there. Okay, put in some carbs inside. Bihun or... My egg drop now. Noodles. So you just beat your egg. Uh, this soup is supposed to put Hi, some corn flour, but Hi, I don't like to put corn flour in my soup. If you uh, are doing any soup or if you're sharpening your knife and you like to share with us, do, yes, do uh, tag me and tag my cooking story. 
tag me and put my uh tag my cooking story. Later I'll show you the handle, social media handle. Tag uh, my cooking story. Follow them also for more um uh, for more uh, updates on the product. They, they bring in nice quality products, original brand. Okay. And also healthy, yes, healthy and colorful. Yeah, yeah, colorful. So you have carbs, you have fiber, you have protein, and then you have soup. Put in some. So I'm going to show you later one more product. One more product you can use from Suha's Fave, okay? Suha's Fave is now 160 points of salt, okay? So, uh, Suha's Fave now is 168 ringgit with promo code is uh, 151 uh, ringgit 20 cents only for five items. Five items makes a colorful day. Wow, yours is ready. Oh, so delicious. Need bacon. Uh, actually, yes, la, need bacon. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot to bring the last one. And when you talk about bacon, yes, yes, I eat my tada prawns. Today, I feel like eating prawns. So, prawns very fast for me. But I just put it in. Today, I'm going to eat this prawn. So, after oh. I bake, all right. Yours is ready. Huh? Yours is ready. Yeah, I got a stool to sit down and see you. <laughs> oh. Mine is Mine is dark. So here, hope you're inspired to make soup for the weekend. Sorry. Mine is almost when the, when the prawn is red, right? It's kind of ready. Just champak champak betul to city, champak champak je. Nanti I makan, you don't feel guilty, but feel guilty pun. Yvonne, I heard you learn a new, new... Be my Oh my goodness, with the prawn ah. Wow, it smells so good. I see. Mm -hmm. Last week, I, I cooked clams with the Jasmine's fave, right? Yeah, that one also you can cook. Can use that uh, pot of food. So you were saying what? I can't really show like this. Can you see? So yeah, very simple, very healthy, and quick. You know. Cooking from home, you have meeting to stand after meeting, you have no time to cook. Yeah, exactly. Meeting. Yes. Always grab, always tapau is so unhealthy and expensive. <laughs> true, true, expensive. Look, look, I love my egg soup it's coming along. Look, look, look. I think it's ready already. Look at the prawns. Prawns don't need so long, right? Yeah. It's turning red already. Okay, so what I like to do is I like to put it back in the, the borosilicate glass. This is very, very useful because um, this kind of glass, right, uh, you can put um, food and it won't react with chemical reactions. Like if you use plastic, it's very, you know, you have here, you don't know whether to put it in the oven. Wow, you're eating already? I haven't even yeah. it. Okay, okay, well, eat, we'll eat. I'll just cook some, put it inside. So after this, right, EMCO, I'm sure a lot of you are going back to the office, okay? So when you go back to office, do take care. Uh, I personally like to bring my own food because so that I don't go out. Yeah, I don't go out. And then um, I use the borosilicate glass because it's uh, oven oven friendly. You can put it in the freezer, you can put it in the fridge. And then you also can put it in the microwave. You will miss. So you can put it this and put it in your bag, and it won't uh, it won't drip. It won't have. It's airtight also. You can put sweet oh, food, salty food. See this kind of meal, this kind of lunch. So if you have this kind of lunch, won't you get slim? My goodness. Tak payah lah go and eat all the very oily food, right? All this is 
prepare at home very easy. Prepare the night before, put it in your fridge. My goodness, the next day just bring it to office. And then you don't have to worry that it's uh, spilling in your spilling in your uh, what you call your handbag or your lunch bag. So I'm gonna do this when I have to go back to office later. I I, I will do this now that I have this borosin cake glass. Um, it's a uh, chemical. Uh, don't have to worry about the chemical. Look at this. This is a good lunch, right? Or not? And then, uh, need MSG, ah. No need lah. No need like like Yvonne is using the mushroom powder, also very good. You can put it down to leave. This is what you bring to work, and you don't have to go no Just mushroom. Eating all the oil you put outside, then of course you don't microwave with this one lah. This one, although is uh. Although it is BPA free, I need egg on my too. Yep, it won't drip, so it won't drip in your bag. Okay, let me go back. Let me go back. Hello, I'm back. So it won't drip in your bag. And with this Suha spade, you get this. Oh, you're eating already. <laughs> Okay, I'm still talking about this. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna bring. I've been fighting for this kind of uh, uh, container. It's 800 ml, so you can put baby food. Uh, not afraid of spilling, and then you can put. Uh, can you imagine? We just take. Let's say you wanna bake something, right? You just put this in the oven, bake it, take it out, put straight in your bag, go to the office, put straight in the microwave, and then eat it. Then put come back home. Put it straight into the dishwasher. All these are dishwasher safe, including this um this wok. Okay, so all of you do remember, yeah, do remember this is the code 10 percent discount. Please, I want all girls to enjoy the 10% discount. Store wide, no minimum spending, and it's also right. It's also right. This no also minimum spending. And do tag us if you cook any soup, do tag us. Uh, follow my cooking story for more uh, uh, good products, affordable and quality products. And I've got two techniques that I can see what I have inspired you to do. You're really eating, oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> it's so nice. <laughs> what is so hey, nice? Because very... I put two big tomatoes. You put, I put two big tomatoes, I put one only. Two big ones some more. Because I love tomatoes. Ones. You like tomato, huh? Yeah, then I put a little bit baby celery. Huh? So mm. healthy. Mm. Healthy. Don't have to eat all the outside food. Just stay in the office and then um Sam Yi Chang Lee say Go into the office, put your um put it in the microwave. You want I thought you're gonna learn uh some jingle yeah I you teach me some jingle now this can is what it's got lots of uh, funny funny things can you hear can turn some then break mana bila pergi nanti i send okay come how, how to do hey. your thing you say you want to teach me right Two, three, two, two, ah. 
土豆土豆土豆派，土豆土豆土豆片，土豆土豆土豆丝，土豆土豆土豆丁，土豆派，土豆片，土豆丝，土豆丁。Thank you guys. Have a great weekend ahead. See you next time.